Yo, what's up guys? In today's video, we're gonna be doing a restaurant tier list. And if we're done with this early, we're gonna do a second tier list. See, so yeah, let's get right into it. So I'm just gonna put whatever I have never tried into the question mark. So I haven't tried a lot of this, unfortunately. I wish I tried more shit, but I haven't I've really tried it. So I'm just put everything I've I've tried on the most. I haven't tried this, I haven't tried this. There's a lot of stuff in I haven't tried. Yeah, I haven't tried White Castle. I haven't tried Whataburger. From any of these restaurants, which one should I try the most? Because I want to try some new shit. So let me know what I should try from, you know, this from this uh place. All these question marks that I never tried, let me know what I should try. All right, and I think we're good. So we still we we barely have any restaurants to rank, so we are definitely gonna do a second tier list. That might be flags, it might be games, I don't know, we'll see. But first, let's start off with Arby's. So Arby's, let's see where Arby's goes. This is definitely not going in the personal favorite. It's not going in S. It's not going in A. I feel like Arby's is way too overhated. People just like going on the hate train, but it's definitely not the best. I'd say a C tier, C or D tier. I'm putting it. Put, I'm I'm gonna put it in the C tier. Yeah, I feel like that's good. So, next up we got Auntie Anne's. Auntie Anne's has some good pretzels. Not ain't gonna lie though, and those pretzels with glizzies in them. Pause. Those are actually really good. So, I don't know if I classify it as a fast food restaurant. I'm I'm gonna put it in B tier. Yeah, it is B tier. So, next up we got Burger King. Burger King, I actually kind of like Burger King. I like their, I like their nuggets. I like the fries. I like the Whopper. It should either be A or B tier. I ain't gonna lie though. Uh, we'll we'll just put in an A. So, next up, we got Checkers. Checkers is actually really good though. Their fries are actually amazing. Their chicken is is not the best, but it's decent. Their burgers are decent. I'm a, I'm, I might put it in the same ranking as Auntie Anne. Or their fries just makes it automatically go above a B tier. So, yep, there we go. Next up, we got Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A is actually really good. Their chicken sandwiches are fire. That new one's fire. Um, their waffle fries are so good. It might either be S or our personal favorite. Thing is, I don't really get it that much. I don't really get it that much, so it might have to go to S tier. Just because I don't really get it too much. I'm sorry to have to do this, but I never tried Chipotle, bro. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Next up, we got Dunkin' Donuts. Dunkin' Donuts is actually decent. I wouldn't call it a fast food restaurant. I don't know if it fits with any of these except for Auntie Anne's. So, I might make a personal category for all this sweet shit. Nah, nah, nah. But I'm, I'm going to put this in C or B. I tried their um, Oreo milkshake. That was actually really good. Their donuts are, their donuts are decent. So, yeah, it 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 it'll. Why well, can't I say it'll go in the B tier? Next up, we got Five Guys, which is expensive but good. I don't know if it's worth the value though. So, is it gonna be S or A tier? Which one should it be? It should be in A tier. Let's get it. I'm in the East Coast, so we don't have in and out <laughs> Next up is KFC. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. It might be a little bit biased, my review towards KFC. Because every every um KFC place that I ordered from is fucking ass. But sometimes I had, I had a good chicken. I had a good fry. I got a good sandwich. But most of the restaurants near me are fucking ass. For that reason, I might have to go to B or C tier. Definitely not better than Popeyes. I feel like it's going to go to the same tier as Arby's. So next up, we got McDonald's. McDonald's is available. It's always there for you. It's not even that bad as well. Those chicken nuggets and fries are fucking nostalgic as shit. It's either going to go in S, A, or a personal favorite. Which one should it go? Nah, but if I put this, then Chick-fil-A has to go here too. Because... They're both fire or shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there you go. There you go. But thing is, I don't really get Chick-fil-A that much. I don't even eat fast food that much anymore. This is just by experience from before. 
So next up, we got Panda Express. I'm going to just say right now, China's, Chinese food is actually mid as fuck. For that, it's going to go into the D tier. Next up, we got Popeyes. Popeyes, it might automatically go to personal favorite. It's actually really good. Their chicken's actually amazing. Their chicken sandwich is good. Their fries are busting. Yeah, that's really good. That's really good. So next up, we got Cane's. Cane's very overhyped. They're, they're good for their sauce, but I feel like they're not good for their chicken and shit. Their chicken's actually is mid, I'd say. It's mid. The fries are bland. The chicken is bland. I might put it in the C or D tier. Let's go with the C tier. So next up, we got Sonic. I really tried Sonic that much, but I tried some shit. It was decent. If I go C, B tier, I'm going B tier. Got Subway. I'm sorry that I have to do this. I ain't never tried Subway. <laughs> I'm I'm actually kind of picky. I'm not gonna lie though. I'm kind of picky. Taco Bell though. Taco Bell is gonna have you shitting for days, but it's actually really good. I might have to put in an A tier. Yeah, I'm putting A tier. So we got two more. Then we're gonna do another tier list. Next we got Wendy's. Wendy's might just go to S tier because it's actually really good. I like their shit. And the final thing, Zaxby's. I actually tried Zaxby's in um, when I and when it was summer. I tried Zaxby's in North Carolina or uh, Florida. It was actually kind of decent. Their chicken is good. The fries are good. I might go in B tier, A tier. By the way, don't get mad at me. This is my opinion. This is my opinion. I still want to try a lot of this this shit on here. So let me know which one sh I should try first. And I might make a vlog on it. So let me know. Let me know. But we're done with this tier list. We're going to get on to the next one. All right. So we're going to do this one. No, nah, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I probably would have gotten canceled. But yeah, we're just going to do an actual legitimate one. We're going to be doing U.S. state flags. So first up, we got Rhode Island. Rhode Island is actually decent. But I'm going to make a new tier for F tier. Yeah, we're good. So, Rhode Island's. Rhode Island's is actually kind of decent, though. Um, it might go in the B or C tier. I don't know if I like the yellow, but I like the aesthetic of it. So, it would go in the B tier. So, next up, we got Idaho. Idaho just looks like every other one. It's kind of plain and basic. I like the little design of the circle, but I'm still going to give it D. So, next up, we got Maine. Mains is kind of like the same thing, but has like it has more details. Like there's there's two men outside of it. I don't know. I'm 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 gonna move them in the same tier, which is C. So next, North Dakota. I actually kind of like North Dakotas. Actually, it's gonna go in the same tier as Rhode Island's. Virginia. What the fuck is Virginia's? It has a someone stepping on a dead man. It's it's kind of like uh these two. So I'm gonna put it in the C. I'm going to put it in the B tier, actually. Uh, Yeah, we'll stay in the B tier. Next, I think... This is Michigan. Yeah, this is Michigan. I kind of like Michigan's. It's going to go in the B tier. I'm pretty sure this is Alabama. So, Alabama. uh, Very weird state. And I don't know if I like this flag. It's going to go in the D tier. Florida's just the uh, advanced version of uh, Alabama's. I actually kind of like it more. So, it's going to go in the B tier. I've been to Florida a lot. It's actually really cool. I don't know if I want to live there, though. There's a lot of crazy shit that's been going on there. But, yeah. All right, since it's here, we're going to do Maryland. Maryland's is probably going to be the first A tier. I actually really like the flag. Okay, so I'm just going to go straight to Ohio's, which is the only one that's not a square or a rectangle. And that's what makes it kind of cool for me. So it might go in the B or A tier. I don't know if I like the little design on it. Yeah, but it's, it's still going to go in the A tier. It's actually cool. This Indiana's Indiana's going is gonna go to the B tier. I like the stars. I like the torch. It's actually cool, but I don't know if it's A tier level. Iowa's is probably gonna go in the D or F tier. I just I just don't like it. It's going in the F tier. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to all my Iowans that are watching this. New Mexico's D or F. Which one should it be? Which one should it be? It is gonna go into the f tier i'm sorry 
I might move Arizona's up to the B tier. It's actually kind of cool now. To be honest, I actually like Hawaii's. It might be the first S tier. I'm going to leave it in A for now, but if I change my mind, I'll change it up to S tier. And also, one that might be in S tier is also Louisiana's. I actually like Louisiana's. And one that might be S tier is New York. It might be a little bit biased, but I don't give a shit. It might be. Uh, these three are in competition for S tier. The first S tier flag. North Carolina is going to be in the C for Carolina. South Carolina is going to be in the C as well for North Carolina for South Carolina. Both Carolinas in the same tier. Yeah. To be honest, this one's going in the B. I like the plain and simpleness of it. it just makes it really good. New Jersey is going to go in the B tier. Vermont is going in the fucking D tier. Wait, no, no, no. I'm being too harsh. C tier. Illinois is going in the C tier. Washington going in the B tier just because of Washington uh, on the fucking flag. I like it. This one's going in the D tier. I mean, not D tier, F tier. This is fucking ass. West, West Virginia, change your fucking flag. Minnesota's, I like the colors on this one. It's going to be a B. California's might also be in competition for the S tier. Nevada's might also be in the competition. I don't know. I like the flag a lot. Same with this one. This one's going in the F tier. This one's going in the C tier. This one's going to go in the C tier as well. I, I, I don't want to rush, though. This one's going in the C tier as well. Then finally, the last one is South Dakota, which is going to go in the B tier. I like this one. So, yeah, which one's going to get the S tier? The first fucking S tier of the video. Louisiana is definitely getting the S tier. That's the first S tier flag of the video. Hawaii is getting it, too. I, I like it a lot. Which one? Which one should it be? New York? New York's is... I feel like New York stands out more compared to the rest of these. That's why it's getting an S tier for me. Not because I'm from New York. It's from actually is is actually because I kind of like the flag. California's is gonna stay in the A tier. I'm sorry. This one's gonna stay in the A tier. Should Nevada goes up? Should Nevada's go up? Should it really? It's simple. It's good. Stands out. It's officially in the S tier. So here's my official flag ranking. So if you guys agree with this, let me know in the comments. Let me know if, if I got this fully wrong. Let me know if I got this halfly wrong. If I got it mostly wrong, mostly right. Let me know. Let me know. So yeah, I'll see you on the next video. Peace out.